Okay, now we're going to look at how we could add a badge to our website. So I'm here in WordPress and you don't have to use WordPress. You can use Squarespace or Wix or Weebly or whatever you want. Most will have an option to add some kind of code to your website, which is what you need to do to be able to add your badge. So I'm here just in a new post on WordPress, but I need to get the code from my badger. So on my badge here, I can go ahead and click the share button in the top right corner. And then I'm going to go to HTML so I can get the code. Now you have two options, the card or the badge. The card uses what's called an iframe and the badge uses what's called a block quote class. So they work differently depending on what you want. I happen to know that WordPress works better with the block quote class, but you may have a website that works well with iframes. So you could use this one as well. The other thing is there are some aesthetic differences to them. You can see that the card only has the option to show or not show your email address, but the badge option has more options. You can choose to show or not show the badge name, the date and the verification button as well. So depending on what you want and what works with your website, you can choose one of these. Now I'm just going to go ahead and copy this code. So I'm just going to come down here and click copy. And then on WordPress, I am in a new post, but I need to make sure that I am in my code editor. To get to the code editor in WordPress, you need to go to the three dot menu in the top right and then go down to code editor. Different websites will have different ways of doing this, but normally it'll say something like code view or HTML view or something like that. So just find that and then you can make sure that you can paste in your HTML. So I'm just going to hit command V to paste that in. You can see there's a bunch of code here, but you don't have to worry about what any of it says. You just need to paste it in. And then when you exit the code editor, you can kind of see it there, but you're also going to have the option to preview most of the time. So I'm going to click preview just so I can see what this would look like. And you can see that there it is in my post. And so there it is on the website. And you could do that on a post or a page or whatever you want to do. Just make sure that you've got it there. And then of course you could publish that and you could add an entire page just full of all of the badges that you had earned. And that is how you go ahead and add a badge to your website.